Monday, started a brand new week, gonna start it all off fresh and feeling great, which is awesome. Um, first thing up this morning, I have a meeting for virtual concert band. We have like a Zoom meeting, so just meeting all of the musicians. Um, that'll run for an hour, and then every single Monday, Costa and I have to do our big grocery shop for the week. So I'll bring you along with me for that one. I always get really nervous starting these meetings and like being the host and making sure everyone has to talk. Here we go. Hi. Hello, how are you? Doing well, how are you doing? <laughs> I'm going well. I, I managed to send a video. I know, I saw, I was so excited. <laughs> Randy, awesome. what is your background? <laughs> okay, the meeting just ended. It went like way over time, but ended it because I'm starving, so I'm gonna make breakfast. <laughs> dirty and there's lots of stuff that we need to get rid of that's like not good anymore um, so that's the current state and this is our fridge fully stocked all of the groceries put away and everything all cleaned out looking so much better I'm going for a walk I did some editing and I just wasn't feeling the best like the vlog just wasn't working out how I wanted it to for yesterday's vlog so I'm going for a walk the sun's setting so hopefully the beach will be really beautiful um the park will be beautiful that I get to walk through and I'm just gonna listen to some podcasts and just get all relaxed and ready for tonight Every time I go on a walk, I just get reminded to take life less seriously. Like, I just got home and I'm in, like, such a better mood. And I'm like, Laura, why are you putting so much pressure on yourself to get everything done? Like, 
we're literally in lockdown right now and I'm pushing myself to be working hard from the moment I get up until the moment I get to bed. I'm either practicing or editing or like working or doing admin or cooking or cleaning. Like let's just take life less seriously, you know? So I'm feeling so much better. I'm going to make dinner and then I'm going to practice and then maybe I might read a little bit and then I'm going to refresh, start editing again. I'm also supposed to stress tonight. Who knows what's going to happen? session i don't remember the last time that i've practiced for four days in a row it's been over a year so here we go okay so i haven't really made a plan for today but what i'm thinking is i'm going to do vado mechum again but i'm going to do even more of vado mechum i might add on an extra half page compared to what i did yesterday i want to do the next one out of the velocity studies i've been focusing on one and two i'm going to scrap number one now we're done with that so maybe today i'll do two and three I want to work on a little bit more of Homage to Bach by Kovacs um, and actually start to work on some of the technical parts of that piece. And then we'll see how we're feeling and if I feel like we need to add on anything else. Oh, my iPad is on 5 cents. Love that for me. I'm literally on 5 cents and it's gonna die. Please don't die. <laughs> Jumps is still not feeling 100%. Um, I feel like I'm gonna have to do some adapt to like get my low notes to come out. Um, but that's actually really not too bad. So I might try that again, maybe two more times, um, and just up the tempo just a little bit, like literally by like two beats per minute. <laughs> Faster. I've now got it on 54, which is great. 
So I'm going to write that down. Um, it says anywhere between 48 and 72, so maybe we can aim for 72 over the next two days or something. But I'm going to have a go at number three, which is working on chromatic scales, and it has a repeat on every single bar. It's supposed to be repeated. <laughs> It's gonna be easy, so number three is done. Number four is looking very similar. I'm gonna play through four just for the sake of it, except I'm gonna take out all of the repeats because that's totally unnecessary. I'm just gonna play it through at 152. on to homage to Buck. I know I can play the opening that's not technically challenging. The part that is technically challenging is from the technical bit, so Allegro aside. So I'm going to practice, I think, the first page and a half. It's four pages in total. I'm going to practice the first page and a half. Um, the tempo is 140, but I am probably going to do it at about 80 for now. Da, 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 da. times over until I'm really confident. I kind of freaked out at the end of the trills. That's feeling so much better. I'm going to try the 84, the 88, the 92. I'm feeling like 112 is my current technical limit for that passage. So I'm going to leave it at 112. I'm going to write that down. That 112 was my record for today for this one. I don't want to push in more because then I feel like I'll be getting into some bad habits that'll stick. Um, so I'm probably going to just work on the next three lines now and see if I can get them feeling good. there for now um but i'm really proud of myself day four done and each time keeps getting longer and longer and today i didn't have to sit down i just kept on going and i actually started to tackle a technical piece and i smashed off some of the velocity studies that i'm like yep they're done so feeling awesome so I'm feeling really proud that I managed to turn today around. I was feeling, you know, really flat for quite a while and beating myself up. And that walk just really helped me, like, clear my head, feel so much better. I just came home and I took off a lot of pressure from myself. I had all of this pressure to get so much stuff done. Um, 
and then you know just cook dinner did some practice like i've still been real productive like i haven't stopped to do nothing tonight or anything so i'm feeling really proud of myself um and that was a really good practice session i'm excited to get into it again tomorrow and see more improvement i feel like i saw a lot of improvement today so that's really exciting for the rest of the night i'm literally just gonna get ready for bed like have a shower and i'm probably gonna read like a chapter of harry potter and the chamber of secrets because i'm up to the second book now um and then go to bed so i'll see you all tomorrow